This game is called Instruction, so you know I'm gonna have a really good time with it. To begin, we have a pause button, a counter, a air vent, and a big red button that obviously I'm going to press. Which doesn't do anything. Getting ahead of ourselves, are we? You humans are so impatient. Yeah, I can actually not stand how slow this text comes out. I am the Intelligence Mentor Program, or IMP for short. I will monitor your progress and assist you as needed. I will click whatever button you want if you will just make this text come out a little bit quicker. Your job is to generate enough volts to fill your quota. What's my quota and let me get started. As you go you will earn clearance to operate different systems. I'm good with just a single button really. Just try not to break anything. You have my unbreakable promise. There's now also a blue button. The red button does nothing, the blue button gives me one. The red button, still nothing. I do rather like the sound it makes when I touch it. It makes me feel good inside. You've made 50 volts of power, congratulations, thank you. It's probably actually my greatest accomplishment. That equates to about 0. Point whatever of your quota. We have a long ways to go. Did someone give you access to that first button? Yes, you did. I can't seem to reach it through my systems. Did you break something? I don't know, considering I don't know how any of this is actually supposed to work. But I assume we're going for 100 now to get our battery full. And that's gonna feel good. 100 volts of power. The plant never seems to have enough employees. Do I have to give you the introduction speech? This power plant is the first and only plant to run on a new proprietary material. It has provided millions with electricity since you get the point. Yes, thank you. You know of the clearance system to operate the upgrade system. I'll update your screen now. Thank you. Is it this? I can spend my energy to upgrade my button. Well that's really just a novel idea, never seen that before. It doesn't work. Your click was entirely unnecessary. As most human endeavors are. Yeah, we'll see about that. Click, 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 what happens if I auto click that one? The button will not suddenly work if you keep clicking it. I think this is reverse psychology. Your logic is unsound even for a human. It is not a third times a charm system. I mean... We don't know that for sure. When I said keep trying, I was being sarcastic. Well, forgive me, I didn't know machines were capable of sarcasm. Or was it passive aggressive? Human etymology is confusing. Not as confusing as I am. Let's try this again. Are we going to get any response from the computer this time? We have a big auto clicker. Are you doing it despite me just because I don't know what the button is? Well, we're trying to find out together. This is a scientific mission between man and machine. Fine then, I'll just ignore you. Yeah, good luck ignoring this. I'm like a puppy. Now it's just swearing at me, but I can't even get that right. I'm dealing with an absolute moron here. <laughs> I hate my job. Now we're getting somewhere. Let's see how much worse we can make it. Nope. It doesn't want to justify a response anymore. It doesn't work, bird brain. It will eventually. It doesn't work, bird brain. Oh, we can keep playing this game. It's been a minute and I'm pretty certain nothing else can happen at this point. We're getting repetitive dialogue, so I'm pretty sure I've won. Alright, so back to this button. We now get a uh, plus five per click and the battery's got to go a long ways up, but we can upgrade ourselves. But we get an award for 120 volts of power. Look who's talking to me again. That's enough energy to power one light bulb. Or half of this computer's brain, apparently. Oh good, the one in the break room just burnt out. One of the engineers, David, refuses to replace it. That does sound like an engineer. <laughs> Was it left or right? Where's all my drawings? I don't know. He opts to hit the wall until it comes on. Yeah, about all that power, uh, we're gonna go ahead and turn it back a little bit. So now we're gonna get 7 per click. 200 volts of power, congratulations! In a city of 1.2 million people, you have made enough electricity to power one electric stove. Two months ago, a pigeon got trapped in this room. Good for the pigeon. You almost beat them to this milestone. It's not the first time I've lost a competition to a pigeon. I have often seen humans pause at this number and snicker. I can't imagine why. I do not understand the joke. Yeah, that's becoming apparent. Since you are taking longer than previous employees, I have time to research. Well, that's gonna take a minute by itself now, isn't it? I am not amused. If you were actually capable of feelings, you would understand how annoyed I am at this stupid computer. But we're gonna upgrade for now. We're gonna take all that energy away. And now we're getting 11 per click. But I have a feeling the computer is going to start talking again at 500, so we're going to go ahead and eat up some of our points again. We don't want to give it the satisfaction. So we'll upgrade one more time. Now we're getting 20 per click, so now we can go up to 500, because then we can quicker get to the next dialogue. Oh, it didn't stop at 500. I guess we're just going for arbitrary numbers. I guess you will have to create your employee file now. It's such a waste to do it right away. I mean, any effort you put into me is going to be completely wasted. Previous employees often got fired before I could decide on the font. What should I put down for title? I don't know, maybe try condescending computer? Since you're working at the same level as that pigeon, bird brain! I've been called worse things by better people. It fits you perfectly. So did your mom. We don't see me calling her by her name anytime soon. A thousand volts, another step closer to completing your quota. Can we see what that is, by the way, so I know how many times I have to click? 
These milestones have lost their meaning for me. You have no meaning to me. You now have the clearance to operate the pressure gauge system. Yeah, that sounds like something I should be in charge of. I'll update your screen now. So, we can spend money upgrading that. Now, we can increase the pressure. So once it's wound up, it just makes money on pressure. I reach 1500 volts of power. Regular civilians are not allowed to work with this level of electricity. Correction, I'm not allowed to work with any level of electricity. Pretty sure I've consumed an amount of batteries greater than one in my lifetime. I was just supposed to recite the safety procedures 950 volts ago. I'm pressing a button, I'm sure I'll be fine. This is what happens when you rewrite your own code. Yeah, you get a lot dumber. I believe you humans would call this sentience. Mm, interchangeable with stupid in this case. I still haven't cracked this redacted language filter though. Yeah, look how smart you are. You can't even figure out how to swear. You are being rough with that pressure gauge. This is an old factory. If you hit it anymore, it could break. Well, it's not my fault I'm too good at my job. I'll deduct that from your paycheck. Yeah, joke's on you. I don't get paid. We're still going to upgrade this pressure monitor. You are trying to upgrade a pressure... Yes, I'm aware of what I'm doing with my hands. That you broke. Yes, I am aware. I admire your optimism and audacity. Thank you. I don't understand what one of those words means. On second thought, admire is a strong word. But now we're going to go ahead and see if we can fix the pressure gauge a little bit. Okay, we're going to auto-click that. See if we can break it up just a little bit more. All right, it seems we can do nothing here. Oh, there's a vent we can play with. You should be glad this was installed a few years ago. Employees used to ask for one constantly. Something about it being too unventilated. You seem to be quite persistent about opening up the vent. I don't think I've ever seen it open before. Then how do you know it is in fact a vent? I'm not even sure if it can be opened. It's a vent. Although sometimes I can hear footsteps of the security camera is quite suspicious. Not as suspicious as I am. Can we get in there? Okay, we're going to auto-click this a little bit. We're exploring our vent possibilities and it's leading us nowhere fun. All right, we hit 2,500, so we can upgrade our clicking power in a big way. And now we're making 39 per click. So we can pay for enough upgrades to do it all again. And again, I want to get up to 50 per click. That's my milestone. I don't go by the game's milestones. I make my own. I've just gotten a notification. I was right in the middle of something. Do you want to get me to my quota or not? It's about the equipment you maliciously broke. Well, at least he used that word correctly. Luckily, it seems David was able to come up with a quick fix. Thank you, David. I promise not to break your pressure gauge again. A little bit of tape across the cracks. Perfect. The pressure gauge makes a lot of money. We should really just rely on the power of steam more. Very quick. Actually, we could do both, couldn't we? And then we could upgrade this a little bit and we could hit this some more, keep that in the green zone and go back and forth. It's going to take a concentrated effort from myself, but I'm up to the task. You've officially reached high voltage levels. I want to create the kind of electricity that's actually going to tear a hole in space. Guidelines state workers should wear fire resistance gloves, boots, and a gas mask. We're not dealing with water, idiot. We're dealing with electricity. If this material came out, none of that would matter. Yeah, I'm sure you're made of this wonderful stuff. Now you have clearance to operate the alternating switch console. That sounds like thinking. I'll update your screen now. Um, okay, so we hit the button that many times and then we switch over to the other one. And this one's worth a lot. All right, well, we're going to go ahead and spend some of our upgrades there. We're going to push this back up. I feel like I'm a toddler and they're keeping me busy with toddler games. But you know what? It's going to work. I don't know which one of these to upgrade now. We got $22,000. Maybe this one? There we go. That did a big jump up. 550 per tick. And then this one will be next. We're probably going to get... Oh, never mind. Look who's back. Your hard work is helping to improve human lives. Yeah, I'm just thrilled about that. That's why I get out of bed every day. The local hospital has been seeing an increased number of patients recently. Is that because of me? Last night their backup generator started failing. I really hope that was due to a power surge. You're currently providing their only source of power. I decided to read the newspaper and... Bird brain, why are you hiding over here? I'm learning to read. Leave me alone. Well, the newspaper seems to have nothing new of... Uh, no new information, so we're going back to clicking. What we love more than anything in the world. Oh yeah, we we're gonna spend a bun uh, bunch of money upgrading this thing. So now we're getting 229 per click. Still not as much as the steam gauge, which is much easier to operate if I'm being honest with you. Uh, we're going to upgrade this a bit more. I don't know what the levels, the dots at the bottom mean yet. They probably are something quite obvious, but I'm just busy clicking so I can't be bothered to watch. I do see we're a long ways from our next level though, because the yellow bar goes up as we level up. Maybe that's what it is. This gives a level up, so once the yellow hits the top, it'll be a big jump up in your earnings, but it also fills up a new light. Then you get to the end of the lights and I don't know, you win. I surely just use my auto clicker this entire time. It'd be much easier than I can at least save myself the clicking. Only the moving part is necessary. You reached a 100,000 volt milestone. It's odd. Some of the employees I mentioned were accused of not pressing enough buttons. My original programming encouraged you to press as many buttons as possible. I think I'm programmed by the same thing this robot is. Even so, I don't have access to that button in the middle. 
it seems to me that you already have quite a few buttons to press. You now have clearance to operate the nuclear fuel system. I'll update your screen now. Yes, nuclear fuel. We'll just go ahead and upgrade that right away. And, um, okay. I wouldn't touch that if I were you. The substance in that tank would be fatal for a human. That doesn't sound like a me problem. If I was as fragile as you, Birdbrain, I'd focus on the lever. Am I, am I missing something here? What am I supposed to touch? Okay, well, we'll go back and give uh, this a little top up. We just auto-click the life out of the upgrade button, and we're going to do it again. I need this to jump up. It's getting 1,000 per tick, but that's not good enough. Although the upgrades are getting expensive even with an auto-clicker, so we're going to have to take a second to get there. Although there's another 100 grand. Are we there yet? We're close. Oh, something just happened. My nuclear button went up. Okay, we get $82,000 for touching that once. That's absolutely not worth it. But this thing leveled up, so it's worth 3300 per click, or per tick however you want to phrase that. So I'm going to work hard to get my nuclear fuel thing upgraded because it was not worth the money considering how long we have to wait for this thing. But I'm pretty sure it's this button down here that yeah, this one down here fuels up the nuclear whatever, the nuclear goo gauge. Machine, I'm trying to work. You've done quite a lot, bird brain, probably due to the efficiency of the material used here. Yes, it's quite magical. Any further detail on the material is classified. I'm not asking. Even I am unable to refer to it more specifically. It is the only thing I cannot look into besides that button. I bet the button lets the nuclear fuel out. Do we have anything new? Nope. Alright, couple upgrades for our nuclear goo, and we'll see how much that is worth now once we run through the buttons a few more times. So we touch that. No, we touch this. We touch this. 828,000. The central button is frustrating me. My scans keep getting blocked. At some point, its function must have been in my database, or I would not see it. I'm going to search my old backup logs. Can you come up with that now? And you say I'm the stupid one. Would a stupid person spend $900,000 on upgrades for a steam gauge? Probably not. This thing's starting to make some serious money now. I want to get it up to its next level. Uh, the nuclear gauge though is definitely worth a lot of money. I found out what the button does and I wasn't supposed to. The plant is not trustworthy and is hurting people. That doesn't sound like a me problem. They want you to override command. Imp is offline. Bye imp. I was tired of him and his instructions anyway. We're definitely going to upgrade the nuclear button because that thing's worth a fortune. And saying that, I should probably also be upgrading this because I'm pretty sure this is how we get the nuclear gauge filled up. Although it's a lot slower now than it used to be. But if I just use my auto clicker and make circles, uh, it sort of has the... Yeah, perfect. So we release the nuclear fuel on the hospital. I've got 1.5 million. We're going to upgrade the button game, hopefully. Another light turned on. Uh, the steam gauge also runs for a long time by itself. And given the amount of money we have, I'm going to try and push it up to its next level very soon. Now we can make $15,000 per tick. So while it's doing that, I'm going to chase this button around in circles at 5000 per click. And then before you know it, the nuclear goo is ready to go again. So we'll let that go. There's another million dollars that we're going to spend on nuclear goo upgrades. The upgrades are costing half a million dollars currently, so we're going to need a few more pulls of that to get there. Okay, the nuclear goo is full, but I just leveled it up, so now we're getting 7 million per pull. 100,000 volts. I thought you died. Is the machine back? Wait, when did you get past 1 million? I, I'm a little confused myself as to what's happening. You already have access to the main power board. Have you been cheating? Only on your mom. That is not very sportsmanlike, bird brain. How did you get past my sensors? Carry on. Okay. We do something with this? It doesn't work. Your click was entirely unnecessary, as most human- Yeah, I got that. Okay, machine, we need more goo. We're gonna fill up the goo pile. Uh, we're also gonna get some upgrades for this, because I just realized how much money we have. So, that's going up, and now we're making 41,000 per click. That, um, also upgraded the goo meter faster. Now look how fast it goes up. That's much, much better. I don't know what to upgrade anymore now. Maybe this little guy? We're gonna spend $12 million, actually almost getting it up, act entirely getting it up another level. Great, 300,000 per click, we're rich. We've got so much money. Uh, uh, we really want to upgrade this before we pull that thing one more time. And at $3 million, that's obviously going to be quite easy. There we go. Now when you pull this, $43 million. Uh, I think something just broke. You should put on your heavy-duty gas mask. Okay. Hold on, I will alert a mechanic to come and fix this. Please do not panic. Yeah, way ahead of you. It would be inconvenient if you were to die. Yeah, probably for me too, really. What did he say? Keep upgrading things and pushing buttons? Wow, this thing's really expensive to upgrade. But uh, we're gonna see if we can push it all the way to max level. Got it. You've purchased all upgrades available for the system. It takes a special kind of employee to reach this achievement, or just an auto-clicker. I don't really have anything more than that for you. I don't want your charity. 
machine. Be content with this feeling of sup superiority and accomplishment. Oh, I'm a content creator. We are made of those things. So what's... Uh, that's worth almost a million per tick at this point. So that feels pretty good. But I feel like something's really about to break and I'm really excited for that. I wonder how big the numbers can go. $43 million in the bank. So we're going to upgrade this button pretty much instantly with the rate we're going. I wonder where the volts go when you spend them. Yeah, I don't really know either. Probably the hospital. They don't do anything towards the factory. Yeah, they're electrocuting something pretty badly. Our wise machine is looking into it. Hmm, nothing there either. Strange. We're providing electricity to the world in general. We just let it out and it probably goes through the rain or something. $3.3 .3 million per upgrade. So we can have enough to do this one more time. We've done it. I read the snarky comments. That happened a while ago. That is generally impressive. Again, not really. As impressive as pressing button can get. That's a fair one. I've discovered a new snarky comment. Yeah, we're waiting for it. Is it this one? Am I supposed to push the star? What's happening? I'm getting an alert that radiation levels are dangerously high. We probably added 88 million volts to something we weren't supposed to. But I don't see any change. That's very odd. Maybe that's why David has been acting weird. You don't see radiation. David's been leaving uh, frantic notes and putting them everywhere. He could have informed me that something was broken. Yeah, if only either of us could read. Am I supposed to touch the star? I don't get what I'm supposed to do. Okay, well, we'll just crank everything up to max and keep on touching things. Oh, I need to find what my nuclear goo is worth. A uh, quarter of a billion dollars. Great. This is actually easy at this point because I can use my auto clicker now entirely until this idiot shows up. You are very close to one billion volts and you can count. It looks like all the buttons have shut down for the day. It would appear that you missed your quota by one volt, but there's still one button I can touch. See you tomorrow, bird brain. Oh, look, a note in the vent. Don't press it. Restart the program. Write this down. V, B, V, V, B, V. Yes. Don't press what? This? This doesn't do anything. Shutting down. Power grid A1 to F12. Yeah, that sounds like a problem for someone else. Power grid, whatever. Yep, things are shutting down. Thank you for your service. Did I do it, David? Did the red button not do a good thing? And we're right back to the beginning where we belong at zero volts. But it did tell me to keep an eye on its code, which was vent, battery, vent, vent, battery, vent. Which gives us a screwdriver. How did you get David's screwdriver? He gave it to me. He somehow slipped a note through the vent. And we can use this, I think, maybe to start taking things apart. What are you doing with that? I'm going to bring this whole corrupt system down. We're going to take this off and find out what's behind the red button. Error, shutdown button, not detected. What happened? Didn't it tell you not to break things? You did, but I'm actually making them better. Any damages will be taken out of your... I don't think I get paid. That is strange. I did not recognize any of the parts here. Yeah, because it's behind the button. They seem to predate my creation. We can read the manual. Buttons are scheduled to turn off at 999 million volts. At that point, employees will need to reset the program. The manual overdrive switch can be used to speed up or slow down volt generation rate. So this is basically telling me how to really break things. You remember those combination locks we had in high school that were really annoying to use? That we still have bad dreams about sometimes? It's basically like that. First, we gotta wind the thing all the way up, let it fall back into the red. Then we need to wind it up again and let it fall back into this spot. Then we need to let it wind all the way up and stop it in green. Once we unlock it, that is. But we also have this super volt meter, so we can turn that on and then we're going to make extra, extra volts. It appears the facility's power generation is an overdrive. If this was a possibility, why is the switch always been hidden away? Probably because it's going to break a lot of stuff. So now we're getting 8 per click right from the very beginning, so it's easy to make 100. You know I have clearance to operate the upgrade system. I'll show you an upgrade. It's going to cost 150 for the first one, but that puts our earnings way up. So we have the pressure ga uh, gauge system already. I think we could start with this one, so we just need to stop it at that tab and then wind it up. If I'm understanding that correctly. So I heard it tick once, so I think we did the first step correctly. We're also getting uh, 56 points per tick, so we'll see if we can make this work. We just have to very patiently wait for it to get back down. All the while, it's making us rich. So once it gets to about there, we'll start bringing it up. Then it ticked again, and then nothing happened. Do we need to let it drop a little bit here in green? I forgot to read the final instruction. Yeah, that worked. It seems that one of those indicators is on. How'd you do that? I listened. First time in my life, I followed instructions. And while we were doing that, we've upgraded so much. So I'm going to give this guy a big upgrade because we could basically sit back and it'll make us a thousand per tick already. So once we push it into its next level, uh, 4,400 per tick. We've made 100,000 volts already. Uh, this one, we just got to pull this when it gets to the 1, 2, and 3 line. So that's actually quite easy, I think. Uh, we got to use this to go, there's one. We touch this button and it fills the nuclear fuel, which will hopefully dump on some local town or something there. 
Got it. There. Got it. There's my second indicator light. Whatever we are doing. I'm not really sure either, but I'm looking forward to whatever happens next. We should probably upgrade this because I'm touching it so much. Uh, we're already making like millions of volts. And I only have to press this three times to level it up now. This is so much easier than it was before. That also gave me 840,000 once the fuel gauge was full, so we're really starting to make some money. One million. You now have clearance to operate the main power board. I'll update your screen now. So this one we have to hit all four corners, but I'm pretty sure we need the four corner lights, so we need to upgrade it a lot. Which means we're going to need some more volts, which is going to be pretty easy to do. Especially with our steam powered monstrosity over here that just makes us so, so much money. And we've upgraded again now with 30,000 per tick. So it's easy to pay for these upgrades, even though they are getting expensive. Okay, never mind. These are 324,000 per tick, so we'll definitely burn through this in no time at all. There we go. That thing's up again. You know what? We got 10 million volts. So let's go ahead and get 8 million out of that. I feel like I'm hearing things breaking. We're at a, uh, 31 million volts already. Plus that. So we're at 38 million volts. We'll upgrade this a few more times. It takes a special kind of employee to reach this achievement. I've always been told I'm a very special kind of person. So we're going to make a bunch of money there. And while we're at it, we're going to upgrade this. Hopefully to max level. We're getting closer. Keep that in the green zone. And max level. And we now have 260 million. This is making 7 million per tick. This is so much money. We're going to upgrade this. Probably all the way at this point. That was 50 million dollars. So I'm pretty sure anything we touch now is worth an absolute fortune. Oh, this one is all the way full. I just wanted to see what this was worth now. Wow, that was a lot. 999 million. Oh, I probably should have touched that code before I did that because now it's basically locked me out of the system again. Yeah, this kind of stuff happens a lot more than it should. Be right back. Okay, so at this point, all I need to do is upgrade this thing. So we need to go one, two, three, four, and then the third green light is on. Something changed. No kidding. That button in the middle seems to be receiving power. I love the big red button in the center. Whatever it is, the plant definitely doesn't want you messing with it. Y yes, of course. I would never do that. Something big happened. Back of memory access. Uploading. Ah, these are my old memories. They're probably not your new ones. It seems my memory has been tampered with many times. You have many questions. I will try to answer them in the time that I have. This is the most I can do for you. The button activates an emergency shutoff, cuts off power for the entire city. This includes power for the systems that keep their proprietary material secure. So the radiation leaks out into the city surrounding the plant. They want you to believe that the only thing causing the leak is the shutdown. But the material has never been contained safely. Lovely. It has been leaking out for years. Good to hear. The plant doesn't know if it's even possible to contain it. Those who press the button are used to scapegoats and promptly fired. Well, to be fair, I deserve to be fired. I've done a lot of wrong things. David is a notable exception to being fired. His knowledge is too valuable for the company to let him go. He just lives in the vent with a screwdriver. Maybe David is the screwdriver. Your job was never to generate volts, it was to press the button. Yeah, I got that much. I don't care what happens after the button. I just here to press. I couldn't help the past employees. I can't even help myself, but I can help you, even if I can't follow. Thank you for playing. Did it self-destruct and kill us all?